I'm Michelle Mabry. I'm a professor of biology at Davis and Elkins College, and I've actually been using Sakai through the LAMP consortium since 2006, both at Davis and Elkins College, and then I was at Lenore Ryan University for a couple of years with the shift to online classes last spring and this year with hybrid classes. Of course, I've really come to rely on Sakai a lot more. So I use it for content delivery. I post my lectures there asynchronously. I still do assignments using the uh, text matching service. Um, and then a big thing with my courses now is I organize all my content using the lessons tool in Sakai. So my favorite thing about the lessons tool is how easy it is to use. Uh, it's very intuitive setting up and selecting how you want it to look, what you want to use. And I guess the second thing, I'm doing two things. The second thing is, is it really helps keep the class organized, both on the faculty side of things and for the students. One thing that I heard from students basically all over the country is when we shifted to online, they were having to go to multiple different sites for their content. So they had to go to their LMS and then maybe an online homework. And then they were, you know, and then a video conferencing. So they were having trouble keeping track of where to go and when they had to go to those other sites. So using the lessons tool, I'm able to organize everything. Um, I do it by week. So I'll say, okay, this week, you know, we're, we're covering chapter five and you have this assignment due and here's an external video that supports the lecture. So it's, it's easy to use and it really helps organize the content well. What I have here is my Biology 309 class. This is Comparative Vertebrate Anatomy. If we go to the Lessons tool over here, it opens up all my weekly organization using the Lessons tool. And if we pick this week, okay. So I start off with just kind of a text block at the beginning saying, okay, this is what you have to do this week. So I say we're doing chapter nine in lecture. This is what we're doing in lab. And then I have a reminder that their next test is coming up and what's on it. And then if I scroll down a little bit, we can see this is where I post my lectures. So for me, lectures are asynchronous. And then I also posted a couple quick external videos that support the lecture. So we can see the links to those videos as we scroll down a little bit. And then if we go to the next week, again, I added that text block for, you know, here's what you have to do this week. So I'm, I'm reminding them they've got a test, when it is, what's on it, the lecture, the lab. Uh, I have a link to an external video for this one. And something that I also like here with this text box up at the top, you can add the student's name. So I kind of put little personalized messages, you know, little encouraging messages, and it will grab their names. So, I'll, you know, I'll tell students, oh, you're almost done, or, you know, don't forget about the test. Yeah, they, they definitely have told me that they liked this format. Uh, they say that it makes it really easy to find what they have to do for the week. Um, so, you know, there's no digging around for multiple sites, trying to remember, oh, you know, do I have an assignment due? When is the test? I've just found it to be very intuitive, very easy to use. Uh, it's, it's, and it's, it's very, it's a very powerful LMS. Um, there has been very few things that I've wanted to do that Sakai doesn't do. So everything I've wanted to do with my classes, Sakai, Sakai has allowed me to do that. <laughs>